trout are the most popular sports fish in the world. They fight hard, taste great, and will lead you to some wonderful places. During this chapter, I'm gonna be showing you some of the main rigs that are used so that you can catch a trout in any lake where bait fishing is allowed. Very confident that'll catch you a small fish, it'll catch you a big fish, and it'll catch you lots of fish. Is that your first trout? Yep. <laughs> and a brown trout too, they're considered harder to catch. A beautiful fish, he'd be good eating, but I think this guy deserves to go back, what do you reckon? Yeah. There you go Haley. you try this one. There you go. Start winding. I'm going to show you how not to get snagged on the way in. Now drop your rod tip low, pick up the slack, okay? Because this is a sinker, keep wind a little bit more. Now you're going to have to lift the wind really fast. Now wind as fast as you can. Day number two, Paul, and it's a different day. <laughs> We've ba we basically had our warm-up day, and now we've got something big on. A couple of bust-offs yesterday evening on six and eight-pound line, and uh, there's some big fish in here. This is a drag. This is six-pound braid and ten-pound leader, and that fish is just headed back to the car park. Oh, he's gonna come up. Oh, look at that, out the back, 50 metres out. We're trying to get out into deep water, away from those snags. So far the fish is winning though, I think, Rob. <laughs> Kick back and learn some knots. There's some essential knots to know. The first of those is the uni knot, and this next knot that I'm gonna show you is an adaption of the uni knot that I've created specifically for when you're using lures. The Albright knot. Make sure you go through the hole a couple of times at the end so it doesn't slip off the end. And that there is the third essential knot that you need to learn. This little clue here is fundamental in finding better numbers of trout. And look at that, a beautiful wild Tasmanian brown trout. Be uh, nudging around about the kilo mark. Very common size in the lakes, great condition. Look, I've covered most of what you'll need. You'll pick up a couple little things for yourself, but all that remains now is for you to get out and give it a go.